Welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to show you how to verify your domain in Meta Ads Manager. Let's begin. Now, the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials. If this is your first time here in Meta, I need you to click the sign up option. And from here, just to follow the on screen instructions, and you're good to go. Verifying your domain in Meta Ads Manager is a straightforward process that is crucial for tracking website interactions and optimizing ad performance. Now, once you are here on the Meta Business Suite, I want you to click on the settings. Now, once you are on the business settings, in the left side panel, you need to look for the brand safety. And that's going to be this one in suitability. Click on domains, click on the uh, drop down menu there's going to be domains and block lists i want you to click on domains and what will happen is as you can see d labs doesn't have any domains yet and basically if you wanted to add and manage your domains click on the add option here because all the domains you have added to the business manager will be listed here we don't have it yet but all we're going to do is click on the uh you have two options request access to a domain your business needs to use this asset on behalf of another business. For example, you're just a moderator on a specific business page. You might want to ask your boss or client if you're working for an organization. But if you do have, just create a new domain. Okay. And this is very important because you need to add the correctly formatted domain you want to associate with your business. All right. For example, you can only verify the root domain. I'm going to type in maybe dplaps.com. So you don't have to put the triple W dot here. It doesn't matter. All right. Or sub page. Now, do not add prefixes at the beginning. For example, if you're going to put in this and the triple W dot, that's going to cause an error. All right. Click on add here. Just wait for it. Now, all I'm going to do is verify your domain. You can, you have two many options. One is you can add a meta tag to your HTML source code, right? You can upload an HTML file to your root directory or update the DNS text record with your domain register. Okay. Now, among the three options, I, I per highly prefer to update the DNS text record with your domain register because these two requires a background like a coding background if you're a programmer or developer you are this is just a piece of cake or a walk in the park but if you don't have the technical expertise you might gonna end up um having problems or issues with your domain right so click on update the dnx text records and you see there's gonna be this is gonna be the guide go to your domain register log into your account and find the dns record section after that follow the instructions to add the text records and this is going to be that facebook domain verification dot and some domains register registrars requires that symbol in the host field this is very important all right because if you mess this up it's not gonna go forward and cl click verify domain and may it may take up to 72 hours for the change to propagate across your servers if the domain status is not still verified you'll need to click on the verified domain again so i'm switching over to the uh hosting platform that i am um, currently subscribed to now in my case i am using godaddy so basically if you're using that depending on the hosting provider in my case just go i'm going to the upper right corner where i can see that my profile picture and I'm going to click the my products all right click on that now once i'm here on the home page what i'm going to do is click on dns all right so you do the same with it, especially if you're using GoDaddy. Now here, it's very simple. All we got to do is cl click the uh, add new record. All right. And from here, choose an option. And that's going to be a text. Add a text. And the value is going to be the, remember, go back to the uh, meta business manager. You need to copy this Facebook domain, copy to clipboard. All right, copy to clipboard and switch back to GoDaddy. 
And from here, put in the number. Name is going to be um, Deep Left. All right. Once you've done that, all you have to do is click on save. All right. Right now, I'm not going to add it because it's going to mess up some of my DNS records here because this website is live. And I'm, for the uh, tutorial purposes, that's how you do it. After clicking on save, you switch back to the uh, uh, meta business. And here, remember that you need to use a DNS to text lookup tool to confirm the record has been updated across your servers before clicking verify domain right here. All right, this is very important. And again, the idea is that it may take up to 72 hours for the change to propagate across your servers if the domain status is still, still not yet ver verified. You'll need to click verify domain again. All right. But again, remember, we haven't uh, saved the text record on the uh, GoDaddy. But if you do have, obviously, this will lead up to the uh, verification of the domain. But you have to wait for like 72 hours, 24 to 72 hours. But normally, um, if there's no traffic or not a lot of data has to be um, propagated, it'll take like 24 hours. In my case, it took like, uh, like uh, 26 hours if I... If my memory serves me right but again just wait for 24 to 72 hours if you encounter any problems along the way verifying your domain here in the meta business click on the help section all right and you might want to click on this search option here all right click on that type and enter you'll get some answers from the documents otherwise the next option that you could do is just contact the meta business help center type in your question if you get an answer right if you don't hover down here to the support center get support wait for it and once you need to switch back and once you get a hold of the one of the uh, meta business support staff and they will give you insights and troubleshooting steps on how to potentially fix the error of verifying your domain here in Meta Ads Manager, all right? And after that, once you have verified your domain in Meta Ads Manager, although it's a straightforward process, yet it is very essential step to maximize the efficiency, security, and compliance of your online advertising efforts, not only to protect your brand, but also to enhance your ability to track, measure, and optimize ad performance, ultimately driving better results for your business. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you again in the next video.